This is just a small video to explain you how images work today in File Organizer. So this might change in the future, but I think it's a bit confusing right now and that's why I wanted to make a short video. So on the right, you can see I have this inbox section selected. Now this is a new feature. It's soon going to be the default way for people to, you know, organize files and to enable it, you need to go into uh, the settings today, go in experiments and activate this batch inbox processing. Once you activate it, you will see this little sidebar and within the sidebar, you will see a list of things that have gone through the inbox and basically what happened to it. So this is a file that got processed before it came in as a screenshot 2024 and it left as 2024 achievements and challenges. Um, it also mentions which folder it had ended up, ended up in and if it's tag and a whole bunch of other stuff actually. Now to check out this file, so this was originally an image, the text got extracted from this image and you can see the original um, image here below. Now, if I wanted to do this for another picture, that's how it would work. So I take a random picture on my Twitter, I can slide it in the inbox, there's a million ways, right? So anything that gets a file in that folder will trigger the inbox to work. So it's, it's a pretty powerful system. Now it's processing this file. I can already click on it. I can already see that it was able to extract the text from it. It's renaming it. So I have some weird instructions in my rename instructions and it adds the image here below. So that's how it works today. Um, and in the future, we'll try to make it possible for you to be able to interact it through it with the organizer, but today it's not possible. Anyways, thanks for having a look at this and I hope that was helpful for you.